So I visited today in Galil el Yon, the Upper Galilee, or sometimes called Eastern Galilee. I started at Tel Chai College uh, and had an opportunity to meet the students uh, representing many different communities, both those in this area and people who have traveled from other parts of Israel to study in the north. I was really impressed by the commitment those students have, not only to their studies, and especially studies in uh, science and technology, but to the north, uh, and to try to stay in the north when they complete their studies and use what they've learned uh, to help the development of this part of the country. Then I visited Migal, which is a private laboratory uh, devoted to biotechnology and agriculture technology. And this is really the focus of the economic development plan uh, of this region. Uh, it's a region rich in agriculture. Uh, it's a region in which uh, there's been very successful uh, medical services uh, developed. Uh, and there's a strong effort by the heads of the authorities, uh, by the local private sector, and by the college uh, to promote those particular areas of study uh, and technological advancement. I also stood at Miskava Am at the overlook of the triangular border region between Israel, Lebanon, and Syria. It's an area, of course, that uh, has known conflict, and the people of this region have learned how to live with a certain amount of instability on their borders. I was accompanied on my view at Miskavam and on the cable car at Menar Cliffs by uh, the head of the uh, local regional uh, councils, uh, Giorat Saltz, uh, who explained to me uh, both the economic strategy of the region and the security uh, challenges that they deal with. The heads of the regional councils uh, made clear to me that this is a region uh, on the march. This is a region that is uh, actively working uh, uh, together as a cluster of communities uh, to develop their uh, economy, to advance their science and technology education opportunities for their, for their children, uh, to attract uh, foreign companies to invest, uh, and uh, to attract more tourists. Uh, it's really a community that has a lot of potential, uh, and I was glad for the opportunity to look for ways that we in the U.S. Embassy can partner with them.